Alright. Hang on, let me try and oh, I don't even want to I'm not even gonna try and clean the lens. The rain is getting that bad. Oh my god. These Ah the God the wind is picking up. Let me try and go somewhere under cover. Okay, I explained this before on the mobile phone, but I'll explain it again for the benefit of those who didn't hear it the first time. This is the Schultz Canal. The section to the left of the blue ropes. God damn it! The wind is nuts! The section to the left of the blue ropes, that was just a creek. Now it's expanded. Wind is really picking up. I'm gonna move. Alright, let's try it again from over here. This is the Schultz Canal. All this rain has meant the creek has burst its banks and it's worked over a construction yard to the left of the, to the um, southern side. And all that crap getting swept downstream. You can see over here, you can see the construction buildings built on still for a reason, might I add. Oh yeah, we've got a car down there. There's a car. That thing, there's actually a few cars. Oh dear. There's a van, there's a mini, there's a couple of sedans. There is shit underwater. This is the car park of the local Centro. They've been evacuating the car park for the last couple of hours. But as you can see, a few people didn't get that message. And there are cars that are imminently in risk and yet no one's decided to come out and move them. This is down by the creek side. This was car park at one stage. And you can see we've got the buildings on stilts, very well placed, and a couple of poor unfortunate cars. The floodwaters are basically reaching up, well, to here. I'm basically standing on the edge of it. And both we have the airport link completely out of harm's way. So yeah. There's another car. Looking like if the water gets any higher, it might start to drift. And um, just behind that sign, we've got a skip, which is starting to list. Looks like it might be on the point of breaking free. Yep. And we decided to live here. <laughs> it's basically really invading the car park now. And people are still trying to get their shopping done. There's the listing skip. As a point of perspective, you see those metal uh, grills at the bridge that the water is flowing over? That was a bridge over the creek. Oops. All the way. Well, the rain seems to have backed off considerably now, but we've got flood waters all the way up this part of the car park. Yep. News crews are all over the place. I've seen it's 7 and 10 at least. As God, I can hear it bubbling. I don't know what that is. Probably the sewer. And uh, some people just didn't get the warning about the cars being underwater. So there are at least probably about half a dozen of the things stuck in this. And water is... Oh god, that one's got its window open. That's even worse. There's definitely water in that one. It's not the next Brisbane flood yet, but it's the worst I've ever seen. I've only moved in here. Look, it's nice that I'm this way to get home. And the water is just bam. There's no way I'm getting through that mess. No, that's a bike path. It was. 
I think I might have to wrap this up, I'm running out of memory space. But my god, <laughs> is it least A, B, C, 7, 10? I'm betting that's 9 over the far side there. But yep, yeah. welcome to the floods, January 2012. Or at least our flood, don't know how big this actually is.